In this video we are gonna talk about 11 interesting facts about Armenia. So let's get started. The oldest winery in the world has been uncovered in a cave in the mountains of Armenia. An international team of researchers discovered drinking bowl, a grape press, a cup, and fermentation jars dating to about 6,100 years ago in the cave at the area called Areni 1, in Armenia. It lost 1.5 million people in the Armenian Genocide. In 1915, the Ottoman government orchestrated the systematic extermination of 1.5 million Armenians, an act known as the Armenian Genocide. Turkey, the successor state of the Ottoman Empire, denies it was genocide, but governments of 28 countries, including Britain, Russia and France, recognize the events as an act of genocide. More Armenians live abroad than in Armenia The events of 1915 forced millions of Armenians to flee abroad, where they established strong communities in the US, Russia and France. There are thought to be some 5.6 million people of Armenian descent living abroad, which is greater than the population of Armenia. Yerevan is also known as the Pink City. Yerevan is one of the most beautiful Pink City that we've ever been to. Her buildings were all made of naturally colored volcanic rocks of varying shades of pink, hence giving her the name Pink City. It has a record-breaking cable car according to Guinness World Records. The longest non-stop double-track cable car is the Tate of Aerial Tramway, which clocks in at 5,752 meters long. The spectacular cable car connects the village of Halizer with the Tate of Monastery, offering spectacular views across the Barodin River Gorge en route. The entire country worships Mount Ararat which is also the national symbol of Armenia Mount Ararat protected Armenia from a super strong earthquake. They also believe that the peak of Mount Ararat was where Noah's Ark was found. But sadly, Mount Ararat is not even within the territory of Armenia. Christianity spread to the now defunct Kingdom of Armenia soon after the death of Jesus, though it took until the early 4th century for it to be adopted, as the state religion. Still, that was earlier than any other country on the planet. Its bread is UNESCO listed. Dinner tables are rarely without huge piles of lavash, a tasty flat bread that is the cornerstone of Armenian cuisine. So important is this humble dish that it was placed in UNESCO's list of intangible cultural heritage in 2014. A tonier, basically refers to an underground earth oven. Armenians love to eat lavash which is this thin layer of flat chewy bread that's made from flour, salt and water and baked in a tonier. Lavash can be kept for one year without turning bad. Chess is part of the curriculum which explains why Armenians are so good at it. Indeed, since breaking free from the Soviet Union, the country has proven itself to be a world beater at the sport. The men's team have won the European Team Championships 1999, the World Team Championship 2011, and the Chess Olympiad 2006, 2008, 2012. While the women's team have scooped the European Championship 2003, the Hagpat and Sanahin monasteries are located in the Tumanian region of Armenia, and they represent the prosperity of the Kyrikian dynasty which flourished between the 10th and 13th centuries. The monasteries were the centers of learning. The monastery of Sanahin was famous as a learning center of calligraphers and illuminators. The cathedral and the churches of Ekmiatsan along with the archaeological site of Zavartnots, comprise some of the most magnificent illustrations of the development and evolution of the Armenian central dome and the cross hall type of churches. This architecture had a profound influence on the artistic and architectural development in the entire region. The monastery of Gegard has numerous churches and tombs cut into the rock, illustrating the highest level of Armenian architecture of the period. The medieval buildings form a complex set of landscape depicting great natural beauty that is surrounded by a cliff on the entrance to the Azad Valley. Giant stone letters dedicated to the founder of Armenia's alphabet. In 2005, 
the Armenian alphabet celebrated its 1600th birthday. In commemoration, it was given a gift of 39 giant, carved Armenian letters, strategically placed near the final resting place of the man who created the alphabet, Mezrop Mashtots.